Hi, Tiago here, and I'm going to show you how you can create a Weld Sketch inside of Weld Cloud Notes. You just go here into the menu that says Weld Sketches, and then add new Weld Sketch. So let's say Weld Sketch, give it a name, Weld Sketch Demo Video 001, and you can either upload a base image or draw your base image. Here's what I, this is what I'm, the one I'm going to use. So it will load our tool, and now you have a blank canvas where you can start doing the um, the weld sketch. So I'm going to do something very standard. So let's say a V a groove with some uh, root face. So I'm just going to put it a little bit bigger, and I'm going to duplicate it and flip it. So these tools above, they are the ones that will allow you to. Uh, so this is bring to front. This is um, flip. This is duplicate and this is uh, delete. Uh, we have these purple or pink um, bars that align things. But in any case, this would be your base sketch. Um, this is the base plates that will then not be editable in the, in the next sketches. So I'm done with this. I'm moving forward. And yeah, we can see the result here. You can go back or proceed. Now we're designing the groove design. So I want to introduce some details um, that will then be possibly edited. So I'm going to put an arrow here to specify the thickness. I'm going to do it on both sides. And I'm going to add some text here. So let's say T1, which will be thickness of the left material. And I'm going to duplicate this to bring it here. And it's going to be T2. Um, I would also like to have some angles here. So you just have to adjust the size so that it matches and then duplicate it, flip it and put it on the other side. And at the same time, I'm going to add an A angle. And here we go. So um, let's move on. And this looks good to me. And let's go with this. And now I'm going to do the groove design, uh, sorry, the weld layer configuration, in which you will be able to introduce the passes that you want to weld. So pretty much you just um, select them here, and now you can duplicate them to match what the weld is going to look like. So I'm just going to do a significant amount of passes, and to top it off, there we go. Uh, you can have more, you can have less. There are a couple of combinations here on the right. But in essence, this is what you do. Looks like this, looks fine. And now we need to classify it. So I'm going to classify it as a butt joint. It's going to be for multi-layer and no backing. And it's good for full penetration butt weld and branch connections. Um, and in this case, it's an actual full V groove. And after this, you are done. And it should show up on, up, up here in the top all the sketches that you've done recently and in here you'll see the most recent ones that's how we create a weld sketch in weld cloud notes